On the 28th of April 1947, Norwegian anthropologist Thor Heyerdahl set sail from Peru with five others on a balsa wood raft. 101 days later, they landed in the Tuamoto Islands. It was a trip of nearly 7,000 kilometers, and it proved that it was conceivable that some pre-Inca South American contact with Polynesia had taken place. Today, that raft, the Contiki, named after the Inca sun god, is on display in Oslo. I think the crew must have had a lot of courage to set out over the ocean on such a craft. Museum's theatre, footage from the actual Contiki voyage is screened. And this brings back memories of my primary school years seeing the film with my class at the local cinema. Clockwork driven 16mm cameras to record the journey and won an Academy Award for the resulting feature film. Twenty years later, Thor Heyerdahl set out to prove that the primitive reed-built craft of ancient Egypt could have sailed across the Atlantic. On his second attempt, he proved it possible. Throughout his long life, Thor Heyerdahl continued to investigate the possible movement patterns of ancient people. On one occasion, he used a similar reed-built boat called the Tigris to sail from Iraq down the Red Sea to Pakistan and then back across the Indian Ocean to North Africa. Through his work, Heyerdahl showed that it was possible that ancient civilizations could have traveled much more widely than had previously been thought possible. Mm -hmm. 